What's up guys? Hola amigos! Então, I am here at the Cruz dos Peregrinos or the Cross of the French. All right, uh, you can see it here behind me. So this cross is a little bit like a shrine. Uh, one could say it's the equivalent of the Cruz de Ferro that we saw on the Camino Frances. It's much smaller of course but uh, as you can see easily people will leave all sort of things all sort of memories here and a, st a stone from home i left a little shell that i actually got from amsterdam uh, and that shell symbolizes for me uh, the the corporate world uh, or the english food uh, as i like to call and that i chew too much of it and i don't want more um but beside of that, a little bit of history, right? That's what I'm, what I'm here for. Uh, because this place also has some history, it's not some recent things. Actually, um, it's called Cross, Cross of the French because, uh, as you know, the French also invaded Portugal and the whole Iberian Peninsula. Now, what happened is that people really hated the French and, you know, tried to kick them out in all possible ways. So when actually Napoleon soldiers were already escaping here, the local people, the local militia, they captured a stranded French soldier and they, they asked to a priest, what are we gonna do with it? And the priest told them, you should not waste one bullet. Tie him to a tree and chop him as you wish. Yeah, you heard me right. So that's what the priest told them. So they chopped them and then they buried the guy here. And that's like, okay, a, rem <laughs> a memory that you don't mess with the people from the Minya region. Uh, you know, these are tough people, North people living in the mountains. And actually talking about mountains, this is the highest point of the Camino. I am dead, guys. I am dead. I was taking a lot of breaks. The, thank God for the rivers and the rain because there's a lot of small rivers and I was just washing myself. It's uh, 28 degrees, I think. It's really warm. Uh, and now there's the last stretch of the walk, but it's like really a few hundred meters and then we're on the top, so we made it. So yes, finally there. See you guys.